this week's Beyond Clean Expert Series episode entitled Zero to Hero, Double Agents in Your Product Catalog was written by instrument data experts Amy and Madeline Woldridge, business analysts at Census Technologies. Hey, super people departments. There comes a time in every superhero's career when one finds oneself with a traitor in their midst. As you fight dirty data in your SPD, you may find that you still have products in your catalog with less than ideal vendor spellings or catalog number formats. Recalled instruments may be hiding in your surgical instrument tracking software. What do we do with these double agents in our own product catalogs? How do we get rid of them when they have valid instrument history attached to them? How do we change them when they have an inconsistent format or worse, a duplicate? Many heroes' first inclination is to delete products with dirty data. However, this may not be the wisest route. We recommend only deleting products in certain circumstances. Is the product no longer in use? Has it been replaced or recalled? Did it fail an integrity test? If you answered yes to any of these questions, then it's most likely safe to delete the product. Does this product have an incorrect catalog number format? Is this product's vendor misspelled? Does the product need some other miscellaneous edit? Find out from your supervisor or surgical instrument tracking software provider what your options are for editing existing products. Stand up for the cleanliness of your product catalog while still maintaining the integrity of your hospital's instrument history. What about duplicates? Does this product exist somewhere else in your catalog with the same catalog number but missing a hyphen? Do you have a product with a duplicate because the vendor was abbreviated? For these scenarios, you will more than likely need to merge products in order to retain sterilization methods, images, IFUs, etc. Root out those double agents and stay clean! Thanks for listening to this episode of the Beyond Clean Expert Series. For more instrument data questions and answers, you can contact Amy and Madeline at marketing at census.com.